was a nice early morning out on a Perth beach. It was low tide so I was able to walk out on the reef. I just had some of my uh, dive shoes on so I could walk on the rocks. The waves are pretty nice and small so I didn't have to worry about getting knocked over. Every now and then I'll just have to watch out for a few rolling waves. I was just flicking out some gold worms off the, uh, the ledge. I was aiming to get sort of skippy snook or herring. A lot of herring around. I had a few bits of old crusty bread that I brought along with me so I was throwing out a few handfuls every now and then. I was hoping to catch a decent feed for lunch. I've just got a size 2, 112 jig head. It's a really small gauge, so it's harder for the fish to flick off. I was just using the gold worms. They're probably as close as you can get to uh, bait for a lure. They're really heavily scented and made out of some form of like vegetable gum. Again, I'll chuck out a little bit of red every few casts. I'm just using my brim set up with a little bit heavier leader just because it's all the rock around. You have to work these fairly quickly just because blowfish absolutely love them. It's a very relaxing type of fishing. It really makes you realise that Perth's a wonderful place. Perth's a place where you can always at least find some breakfast. Crack the neck, bleed them, and chuck them in my cooler backpack. I've just got a big bottle of water that I've frozen overnight. These silver brims seem to be following me at the moment. Herring are schooling fish as well, so once you catch one, you're probably going to catch another 10. And you really need to capitalise when they're biting. If you're using bread or other burlies, you can keep them around. Even a bit of fish oil works well. The relaxing morning was over after I dropped my reel in the sand. Totally screwed up the uh, drag. And I was pretty much useless with that rod afterward. I switched over to my Taylor rod and I managed to get a few on the uh, Savage Gear missile, but they're all fairly small, so I chucked most of them back. I dropped off half the catch to my mate Luke and then cooked up some lunch. Split a chilli and smashed up a few garlic cloves and uh, chucked in some butter and olive oil. Dusted the fillets in salt, pepper and a little bit of flour. 60 seconds and turn. Paired it with a generous amount of mayo, Swiss cheese, dill pickle. Beautiful. I was outdone by Luke who made some bao buns using my homemade pickles. 
For more Perth Metro videos, please subscribe. Feel free to ask any questions in the comments section.